Hey what's up guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're back and we are doing uh, the uh, just a look through of the ratings refresh. Okay, so getting right in here, there's some text here. If you want to pause the video now and uh, read through it. Okay, so let's move on. Um, so here's the key updates. Hazard got a plus one. Lex Sanchez also being moved to a striker's got a plus one. Felipe Coutinho moving to a left wing, got a plus one. Diego Costa only got a plus one. Uh, also, his play of the month card will be upgraded to an 89. Eriksson getting a plus one, and his informed card has not been touched. Same with Harry Kane, plus one, and warm cards have not been touched. Joe Matip getting a pretty deserved plus one, and his screen card will not be touched, as uh, stated at the very, very bottom. Uh, N'Golo Kante plus 2 and his uh, Wonder Watch is now going to uh, 85. Yep. And his also his Inform will be 85. Uh, Adam Lana plus 1 and his Inform card I don't think will be touched. Uh, Ander Herrera 83. Pretty deserved there. Roberto Firmino plus 1. Really, really deserved for Firmino. Also being moved to a striker, which you can do already in the game. But yeah, uh, plus two for Deli Alli and his cards I don't think will be touched. Um, Virgil van Dijk, that's a really, really good card now for Virgil van Dijk. Plus three, also he could be like a good partnership for Chris Smalling and stuff in the Premier League. Moving on down uh, to John Henson, who's moved to a CDM. Probably, I think, yeah, most of his upgrades are being... CDM like upgrades. None done this pace of shooting. And then we move on to a pretty, pretty shocking one. Uh, Adresa Gaze. We've got a plus six. A plus six. Making him an, a rare gold. 82 rated. Pretty, pretty decent stats there. Oh, I really want to uh, want, I really, really want to check him out. Moving on down. Cashers Michael. A pretty shocking upgrade to a plus one. I think he should have maybe got a downgrade. Moving on down. Antonio Valencia. I don't know if he deserved a plus two, maybe a plus one. Um, Kyle Walker, plus one, pretty decent. Nothing done this pace though, so not really that good. Uh, Manny, plus three, upgrading his Wonder Watch card to uh, 87. And also his inform, his recent inform to 87, with 99 pace. And then Danny Rose, left back, uh, going up to a plus one. So pretty similar stats now to uh, Luke Shaw in the pace defending. And Luke Shaw is just one more physical, I think. Dwayne Defoe, the Sunderland saviour, is keeping it going. And has got himself an upgrade, plus one. Bellarine got a plus one. Nothing really done to his pace or defending. So I don't know what the hell is going on here. Not really a big upgrade there for him. Also, a guy deserves probably a better upgrade than a plus two. Marcus Alonso, maybe I think he should have deserved an 80 rated card. Maybe a bit of better defending and shooting. As he has scored quite a few goals. And then here is the, the rest of the people who have not been stated above. Negredo upgraded by one. Zaha upgraded by one. Uh, Amrabat, who I'm pretty shocked that he's actually a right mid. I thought he was a striker, but you can just put him right forward, and right forward people seem to play uh, like a striker anyway. Going up to an 80. Ming Sun going to an 80. Wanyama, 79. Divi Gorivi, 79. Alonso again going to 79. Moses, 78. And yeah, there's the rest of the list. Marcus Rashford, 77. Pickford, 76. Going three upgrades. Darren Randolph, pretty a decent one there. Looking forward to using that card. Harry Archer, another Irish person, going up to a 75. Both going up to a bronze. The Tom Davis going up to a 58-64. And there's United goalkeeper there above him, going up 10 ratings. Probably the biggest upgrade of them all. And then here is the first ever downgrades. And you see there, Otamendi going down by one. Steve Mandanda joining them, going down by one. Uh, Swinesteiger going down by one, Cato Bravo going down by two, pretty pretty deserved, has been pretty pretty shocking for Man City. John Terry going down by two, pretty pretty 
good there because he has not uh, played any games really this season for Chelsea and when he has he's played pretty pretty poor. Same with Hiff and Morgan, pretty pretty poor season for them. Hiff going down by two, Morgan going by, down by two. Lazar Markovic, pretty shocking one, is he's only been at Hull for a couple of weeks and he's got a two downgrade. Another Hull player, Niasse, also he's a loanee of Everton, going down by two. John O'Shea going from a gold to a silver, same with Stephen Ireland, both going down by two. Same with uh, Joe Bell, going down by two, all going to a 74. And then we got another shocking, last two ones are pretty big downgrades. Bakri Sacco going from a gold to a 72 silver. And Tramel going to a 75 to a 71 silver. Okay, so if you want to read this stuff, I'll pause the video. But also you can go to the website above, which I'll link in the description. So yeah, let's get in now and we'll do the SBCs on the console. And yeah, I'll see ya. Okay, so now in the background you can see me uh, completing SBCs. Okay, so um, got to do a speed speed of them instead of me talking right through them all. I'm just got to talk over them. Okay, so there's the last one now, and now let's get over to the store and open up the packs. Okay, so we have three premium gold player packs, EPL ones. So we get three EPL players, and first one we get Eddie and Capu from uh, Watford. Yeah, we didn't want them. We don't want them. And no one else to partner him in the pack. Okay, send that all to the club. Let's move on to the next one. Okay, big player here. And they actually get Pedro, which is pretty, pretty decent. I'll take Pedro. Pretty bad that these are untradeable, like they should be tradable. Get Bessage is also in the pack. And yeah, let's move into the last pack. See who we do get. Hopefully it's someone good. And yeah, Peters. Not really any good, but we do get Robbie Brady, which is pretty pretty decent because it's his transferred card and he is pretty pretty good and if you didn't see his free kick goal then like where are you at like against Chelsea amazing amazing free kick on his debut also for uh, Burnley should have gotten an inform this week but he didn't but yeah that's going to be it for this episode guys really hope you did enjoy and also there's the promo packs which I'm probably not going to upgrade because I'm skint or per if you don't know what that means yeah, really hope you enjoy and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.